Hey, what's up, people? Uh, all right, let's fill it up. I have some topics that I want to talk about today. Yeah, what's up? Alright. I hope the quality is good. How is the quality? You need to reset and activate audio. How is the audio? Yeah, how okay, quality is good. Alright. Let me let me start with like some topics because uh a lot of people saw uh that I wasn't that active in the last couple of I think in the last month or like in the last two weeks. I had the culture tree drop. I don't know when culture tree dropped. I think it's now three or four or five weeks old, I don't know. And after that I disappeared for a longer time. So uh, I'm gonna break down the Avalon uh, melody later from Suicide Boys, but uh, I wanted to talk about some stuff and like, so why I wasn't that active anymore and audio off. I don't know. Is the audio off for people? How is the audio? Audio works? We're listening, okay. All right. So, um, it's good. All right, so I had hella bullshit going on the last couple of months. Like, first, let me, let me start with the first one because there is a lot of shit that pissed me off. All right, so, you know, you guys know that, like, you know, I'm having my clothing brand. So the first thing that fucked up uh, was like, uh, you know, the brand Palace, you know, the Palace skateboarding brand. First of all, they fucking sued me. Like they sued me to like put up my merchandise because it's Palace, you know, like it's Palace with a V. And I'm like, yo, what the fuck? And I'm like, yo, first of all, like this is just merchandise, you know, this is for my fans. And like. First of all, you guys need to know, I sell out every clothes collection. We make like 500 pieces or 400 pieces. I don't know. The first one was 400. The second one was 500. The thing is, we don't even make money really on that. Like you got to think about it. Like we, we selling a t-shirt for 59 bucks. I pay in production 30 bucks just for the fucking t-shirt because it's made in Portugal. Then it comes here. Then I'm gonna make a whole sound bag, like like sound pack with a USB card. The USB card costs three dollars in production. The packaging costs three dollars in production. The fucking uh, shipping costs like five, six dollars, and like, like I don't know. Like this is crazy. Like this is ridiculous. I make on a T-shirt ten dollars, and then I split it with another company because it's doing like my shit. And that's why we had a giveaway on my website, and like people still to this day didn't got the. Uh, the hoodies and t-shirts from the giveaway because me and my company we were like you know we we talked to each other and like this was a fucked up situation like this was a huge deal like huge deal all right second of all i uh, got a nft project i know a lot of you guys following they want to hear loops and shit so not a, not everybody you know heard it but like, yeah, we, we did like an FT project and it sold out in like one hour, 50 minutes, half a million. It was like half a million US dollars. And uh, it was a lot of work. Like it was crazy work. And yeah, so those are the two things that like wasted my time completely. That That's why I wasn't that active and shit. Third of all, uh, my contract ran out on the 25th. So... Uh, I had a lot of work to like, you know, 
getting all those deals and like thinking about where I'm gonna sign and this is this is very I want to ask this because th that's why I did the live stream um, I feel tired like I feel tired of the loops and the melodies that are playing in hip-hop albums like I don't even I can I, I swear to God I can't listen to hip-hop album from from the beginning to the end anymore I, I I can't listen to it anymore I feel like it's boring like it's really boring like I don't know if I if I'm the only one feeling like this but like uh, for an example like if I go to the Polo G album this has nothing to do with any producer or Polo G as an artist nothing I can't listen to it like it's the same beat over and over and over and we making and then I open FL Studio and if I do melodies that are like complex nobody picks them It's like I open FS Studio and like I can do so much, but like I need to play two chords, two chords and a bell melody on top that is detuned. Like, are we in 2018, 2019? Like the market is so over, over saturated and I did millions already. I, I made money. I don't need to make music anymore. I just make it because I love it. And it's just like, it's like tired. It's like all the same bullshit over and over again and like you know like maybe you guys don't feel like that but like as somebody who makes loops for like three years like for three years it's just like bro it's like the whole shit it's like i'm playing the same two chords over and over again and people take those and i'm like yo i don't know what music is anymore like what is what is what is this like i don't i i can't understand it why i send somebody a pack of loops and like they don't take it when I have more than three chords or four chords in there but then I do a pack of the same old ass bullshit with flutes with like ethnic sounds and two fucking chords and it gets placed does it make money totally do I need no do I need more change do I need no more money to be like more uh, happy absolutely not So I, I'm living comfortable. I everything that I have own is paid. I don't uh, drive rented cars. Uh, rented cars. I don't rent my crib. It's everything is paid. And so, do I spend time to fuck myself up even more and just make those two chords and over and over again or those three chords, or do I make a break? And I decided, fuck it. I can't do that shit anymore. Like, I'm doing that shit for so long. Like, for so long. And making those three chords with bells and the same UAD fucking FX bullshit and guitar pedals to get the uh, detune sound again and again. Like, this shit isn't healthy. Like, I'm telling you guys, this shit isn't healthy. It's not healthy for my mental health. It's not healthy for this fall industry. But the thing is, the results are crazy. You know what I mean? Like, I make the same shit. It gets placed. It gets fucking placed. It gets on the biggest albums. It gets on Young Duck's album. It gets on the Migos album. But what I'm doing, it's like two chords. And this is what you guys want. This is how we develop this shit. Two chords. And everybody uses that shit. I got, I got a crazy offer. Like, I gotta tell you. I was uh, in the progress of making the Suicide Boys album and um, you know Scrim from Suicide Boys he told me uh, fuck I, I, sorry I forgot the producer who made the Playboy Cardi album so special uh, fuck who was it this uh, fuck you know guys this legendary, legendary producer who like made this like super edm -y electric sound who was this guy Filthy, filthy, yeah, yeah, filthy. And uh, Scrim asked me if I can do uh, those. You know, I, I did five of them and then I was tired. I was mentally tired. I'm like, yo, this shit is like, it's cool, but it's it's not me. You know what I mean? Like, it's not me. But like, I respect the guy because he loves what he's doing. And I don't love doing it. I love doing samples in my way, you know? So, uh, the thing is though, if I do samples in my way, everybody loves them. Like 
Yo, this is something you guys need to know. Back then, I was live streaming every week my new loops. You know? I was live streaming every week my new loops. It went on YouTube. Everybody went crazy. They said Palace is the best loop maker. Did you ever heard? Did you ever heard any of those loops that I played on the live stream in any song that I placed? No, because it was good fucking loops with hella progressions and breakdowns and like a lot of instruments, but it can't get placed because it's too full or like it's too many chords or the rapper is like, no, we, we can't put the shit on, you know what I mean? But then I do two chords and a guitar pedal, like an analog guitar pedal on fucking bells and everybody get and this shit gets placed and like gets placed on the biggest albums. Bro, that shit is sad. That shit is hella sad. And I, I, I would lie if I would tell you that I enjoy what I'm doing right now because it's the whole opposite. Let me go. Let me go on my Spotify list right now. Let me go to my favorite songs. All right. Let me go to my favorite songs. Liebling songs. All right. Here we have it in Germany. All right. There isn't one... There isn't one hip-hop song that I added in the last 50 or 100 things, you know? And that's because it's tiring. It's tiring. Is Germany racist? Yeah, definitely. Because me and Gunboy are always around and I see racism in Germany a lot. Um, so it's tiring. It's like... Polo G sells 180,000 copies and... I'm like, bruh, it's the same song over and over again. And that's not a disrespect to the producers. That's not a disrespect to the rappers. But obviously, it's not the musicians. It's the fan base. It's like the fan base isn't getting tired. Like, are you guys not getting tired of the same shit over and over and over and over again? Again, Gumboy's beats are boring. Bro, Gumboy's beats are like my beats. We do boring shit because that shit gets placed. And it's fucking sad, bro. It's so sad. Like, it's mentally... I don't understand it anymore in the last couple of months. It's like, I'm sending uh, sample packs out that are very special. And then I have... Because I tested it. I have a sample pack of special things where I put a lot of music theory is like, you know, behind it. And there's a pack with two chords and bells and uh, some, you know, uh, some... Uh, what is it called with guitar pedals so it's like detuned and this shit gets placed this shit gets placed that i do in 10 minutes and this shit that i do for one hour nobody even wants to hear it because they're like no it's it's the beat is going to be too full for sure it's need to be simple but like this the, a lot of this stuff is like it's getting boring it's getting very boring and i don't know why nobody speaks about it everybody is live streaming themselves in the in the studio and making the same beat over and over again and that's not a disrespect to any producer because they know, they know they're going to make money. They know they're going to make money. And I know I'm going to make money too if I do those two uh, chord progressions again and uh, put bells on it, put like ethnic flutes on it, make it super dark so it sounds like, you know, some dramatic film. But it's tiring and it's fucking, fucking up mental health. Like, this is fucking up mental health. It's, I feel like a roboter. Going into this program, doing the same two chords again because I know it works. You know what I mean? Like all the shits again and again and again for three hours, all the stuff. And that's, I don't know where the problem is coming from. It's just, that, that's, it's, it's tiring. I don't, I don't even understand it. Like that's, that's, that, that's why I wish luck to every new loop maker because I'm doing the shit for three years straight. Just loops, just loops, sitting in Germany, loops, loops, loops. And the industry is not trying anything new. Like, I swear to God, like, after after the Polo G album, it was the breaking point. I was like, yo, this shit is done. It's like the same shit over and over and over and over and over and over and over again. And nobody is doing shit. Nobody isn't even risking it. Nobody is even fucking risking it. And... Uh, yeah, money is the root of all evil, and I can tell that if somebody is mad at me, I don't give a fuck. I made enough money to chill. I made enough money to chill. I want to do really good music. I want to do fucking amazing music, and I know I can, but I, I can't right now because 
My job is not to go to the studio. So I don't see the art as life. I just send it, the, the loops over. And if the loop isn't easy or isn't two chords or three chords, they don't use it. You know, Tyler, the creator, Kendrick is fucking amazing. Do I have p uh, connections to him? No. Do I have connections to Kanye? No. You know what I mean? They risking something. They're making unique art. But those trap producers, it sucks, bro. It's the same fucking shit over and over again. Like, like I don't get it, guys. I don't get it. If, 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 you, if this makes you fun, I don't get it. There's something really wrong. And nobody's talking about it. I'm talking about it. My contract ran up. I'm looking for a new contract. You know what? I, where I want to sign? I want to sign somewhere where I can do pop music. Where I can do really, really straight up radio pop music. Maybe then I can finally do four chords. Because if I do four chords now, it doesn't work anymore. I, I, one chord, two chords, three chords, max. And yeah, I, I get it. You know, I get it. It's like easy. But like, guys, it's like crazy. It's like crazy. How can you listen to it? Like, if, if I open Spotify, there's not even a one trap song in the last uh, couple of months that like any album that came out, I can't listen to it anymore. It's like the same shit over and over again. Not leaving Adrian Mafia, guys. Like, that's, that has nothing to do with Adrian Mafia. It's just like the contract where like it's collecting royalties, ran up. I have a big catalog. I can go to a big company and like, you know, sign it off. All right, guys. And um, just uh, because I was away for a month and yeah. Oh, by the way, yeah. So, uh, so you guys know. In the meanwhile, I was very like pissed off at music in general, you know. And I, guys, this has nothing to do with Adoid Mafia. I'm always Adoid Mafia. I love Southside. I love Broke. They put me where I'm at. It's just like the company who's collecting the royalties. There's this ran up and now I can, you know. All right. In the meantime, while I wasn't making music because I was tired, uh, I secured a job. I'm like in, like when it comes to NFTs, you know, guys, I'm very advanced in like, in like crypto space and like shit. And yeah, I can proudly announce that like I'm the lead advisor at Porsche now for NFTs. And I'm the lead advisor for the Hustle crypto token. And yeah, those are big things. Like uh, people trust me a lot on this one. So yeah, so I can proudly announce that I'm doing the NFT Porsche. I'm a lead advisor now. And yeah, this is uh, in the background while I'm doing music, you know. And yeah, so I know you guys want to break down. So let me give you a breakdown. And after this live stream, uh, you can swipe up and I'm going to do a free, NF a free sample pack because I don't give a fuck. So you guys can uh, have some fun with this loops that I, I only did like 10 loops in one month, you know, because I was tired of. I was burned out actually doing loops. All right, whatever you guys want to break down, I'm going to break some melody down. So you guys have some content because I was missing a lot. And uh, this time there will not be some sample pack on self. I am going to give you all the sauce now because I don't give a fuck anymore. All right, where is it? Let me, let me find real quick the, the music file for Suicide Boys Avalon because everybody said the synths are crazy. And I'm going to give it to you. And after the story, um, uh, after this live stream, go to my story. I'm going to upload like a free sample pack of like 10 samples that I just made in the last month because, you know, I wasn't that inspired to do it. All right, let me get this one. Yeah, I'm sorry. I just needed. I, I just needed to get my thoughts out. You know, I think. I think this was the melting point, and now it goes up again. But like, I I really was tired, guys, and I can't lie. I you know, guys, I never lie. I always tell people if you don't have the money, go on uh, Pirate Bay or whatever Reddit and get all the sounds for me, steal it, all that shit. I don't give a fuck because I was stealing shit too when I was uh, in your position, guys. All right, let me see why is the sound not working. Oh, fuck, guys. I need to put cables in. Uh, I need to put cables in the monitors. So 
Give me one second. One second, guys. Oh, shit. Do -do. All right. So the PC gave me a blue screen when I plugged in the monitors, <laughs> so... I need to restart the PC and then I'm gonna give you the guys the breakdown. <coughs> and yeah, I hope uh, you guys under I hope you guys understand it, you know. So uh, like super getting super tired of doing the same shit all, over and over again. I hope uh, I will do was is with Danny Wolf. Wait a second. I didn't saw what uh, Danny Wolf was doing. Somebody can write it down, and because I have I have contact with Danny Wolf, and he was actually super fair with me. But like you know, I'm not a small producer, and I have good lawyers. So yeah, I mean, like I saw I I, I saw a stream from Nick Mirror, and like even he, like I, I saw that. It, I think this guy isn't happy to making the same music all over again, but he know it works and he know it makes money. So that's why people do it. And yeah, it's tiring to make a melody with one chord all the time. Like it's very tiring. All right. So we have the file for the Suicide Boys song. Let's open it up. Uh, Danny Wolf scam smaller producer and didn't give them money for collaborations. Oh yeah, that happens. That happens. What should I say, man? People doing a lot of shit in this industry. That's why it's good for me to branch out and do different projects. You know, I'm super excited to be, uh, to do the Porsche thing and Actually, the Porsche thing will probably pay me more than three years of music, to be really honest with you. That's very funny. A funny fact. But yeah. Alright. Sorry guys for the wait, but like, my PC blue screened. Has, has Southside stopped producing? I don't know. I, I, I didn't have a call with Southside for two months, so I don't know. All right, let me see if this is the file. All right, this is the file. I just need to do the audio settings. It's crazy how often FS Studio crashes like randomly on some bullshit. Like, I don't understand it. All right, guys. Uh, there's nothing to hide. Fuck it. You're gonna see the screen. All uh, right. I don't. I don't. I don't even know what I did here. So let me go through it. This. That's. I didn't open it for a long time. So we have two keyscapes here. I don't even know what it was playing. Oh wait. Two times keyscape. It's doing this shit. <laughs> Fucking one chord again. You know, like imagine starting up with this all the time. This is very tiring, you know. Then I have probably some articulations right here. It's like uh, kinetic toys. So uh, this is playing this. Oh shit, I need to mute it. Yeah, this is just playing an articulation, you know. Yeah, so small articulation here. I don't know what this is. Ah, those are high bells. With delay on it, you know. Uh, this is uh, Avalon from Suicide Boys. 
uh, a lot of people ask me to make a breakdown and the breakdown was for this like you know you guys see it like everybody wanted to know what i did here and it's just this So yeah, you see guys, this is what I mean, like, imagine waking up and making this for three years, like, it sounds cool, but like, it gets tiring. And here's the patch, if somebody wants it, it's probably in the hardware library. Yeah, it's in the hardware library. So this is where you can find it, plastic glasses, everybody wanted to know it. Uh, and this is, yeah, this was it. <laughs> Then it had a B part and Yeah, this is actually probably the easiest melody. Yeah, and everybody loves it, so and then we have this. I don't even know what this is. Sounds like, uh, okay, it's <laughs> crappy radio. <laughs> I don't know. Let's see what effects I put in to make the crappy radio into some cool radio. This was the normal shit, you know. Yeah, so we got this. And then we just go to the chords. Wow, this is the most inspiring chords ever. Yeah, so this is the most requested breakdown of a melody and you guys see that's some bullshit with fucking one chord so i don't know what to say it's just tiring making the one chord melodies and it gets placed it's very sad but this is where we are at hip-hop in 2021 make one chord put reverb on it and gets placed that's it yeah all right guys so um uh, i'm gonna upload a pack now and uh, in the story you can swipe up and uh, make some beats with the samples that I did in the last couple of days like for free you know I'm not trying to sell you guys something where I'm not proud of or like you know not feel so motivated because when I sell something I really put time into it and palettes, free loops, uh, night, July let me upload it and then you guys can have it. I hope somebody uh, recorded the whole conversation and put it on YouTube so we can have a little bit, a little talk about it, you know, because I, I, it, it, there's no way that I'm the only one who's feeling like this right now, you know. And yeah, like where is the auto samples? Uh, getting the auto samples and I'm gonna upload it. So yeah guys, check my Instagram story in five minutes and you can have like 10 free loops or something and have a lot of fun. So peace out, I hope you enjoyed the live stream and yeah, peace, love you guys.